Trellising cucumbers. Welcome. I'm Andrew, the Fairweather Farmer, and this is our greenhouse. Trellising cucumbers. First thing you've got to do is to find the base of your plant. And once you've got your tomahawk up on the wire up top, I attach them with a clip. And I basically just use this part of the clip, the little bump there, to close onto the string and that secures it in place up top if there's a wind and the top metal um, <clears throat> if there's a wind and the top metal support gets shaken that way the tomahawk stays in securely in place up top it doesn't fall and the plant doesn't fall so I take the string and with a cucumber it's very important since they have a sensitive root system that you are delicate. You don't want to be pulling on this plant at all or um, you know uh, having the cord be too tight because if the cord is too tight it'll pull it from the top. So that's why I have the cord a little bit longer when I'm trellising cucumbers as opposed to tomatoes, so I let it dangle on the ground and then I just attach one clip very loosely to the base of the plant and I never put any tension on the cord whatsoever. I'll just keep putting clips underneath branches all the way up the plant and the plant will just kind of lean on the cord. I put a lot of clips to make sure that it's supported because if the cucumber goes too far without having a clip, it could kind of get a kink in it. Because what we're also going to do during the trellising is pruning. But if you want to check out how to prune cucumbers, there will be a link right up top. There. <laughs> and you can check that out to see how to prune the cucumbers but mainly we're going to be removing any fruit, flowers, or tendrils. So by removing the tendrils, the plant is not going to have a way to grip onto the cord on its own, so that's why it's important to put a lot of clips. And there you go, you have a trellised cucumber plant. I haven't done any pruning on this guy, so what I do... Briefly, just without too much detail. Go down, take out the fruits, flowers, tendrils, and I would leave just one tendril at the top for it to grab onto. Make sure that I take off any suckers, because there are suckers on cucumbers as well. So if you want to know about that, I'll show you what those look like in the other video. And there you go. That's a trellis cucumber plant. Mm -hmm. 